Hearken well in Hall of Kings. Ah. On ocean steed, my words gain wings. Oh, oh then speed I forth will bring. Ah. A noble deeds that I us sing. Well, hello my gaming family and welcome to another video. Ok, the Assassin's Creed Valhalla is finally out and the biggest question guys, is it worth playing? The answer is definitely yes. The game is absolutely amazing. To be honest with you guys, I had some doubts. I didn't expect that much from the new Assassin's Creed game, but this one, ooh, one big wow. I am a big fan of Nordic culture and Assassin's Creed series and to be able to play this game set in Viking era is in my opinion really fantastic. So the first thing is the atmosphere in game. If you watch and liked Vikings TV show then you will find the atmosphere in this game really attractive. On the very beginning you take a role of a young Eivor in the night his mother and father were killed. While you play prologue you can definitely feel the atmosphere. Doesn't matter you watch the fight through the eyes of a young Eivor, in those scenes you can see how the Viking battles will be later. Now before we continue I just want to thank you for all support so far, our gaming family keeps growing day by day. I hope you guys enjoy watching my videos and if you do then make sure you smash those like and subscribe buttons, it will be really helpful. We are so close to that first 1000 subscribers so help me reach that first checkpoint. One more time, thank you and love ya all. Now when the prologue ends you'll be able to choose the gender of the protagonist. To be honest with you guys I didn't want to play as a shield maiden in this game, I wanted to go as a true viking warrior so I chose the male protagonist. I don't say I don't like female characters, for example in Odyssey I played as Cassandra cause the Alexios had boring personality, I found Cassandra much more interesting character. In Valhalla I wanted to play as a viking warrior, the berserker, so I instantly chose the male Eivor. When it comes to controls and feeling while running or climbing, for now it looks and feels really smooth. I have to mention that I have played only few hours and these are my first impressions, so I won't go in depth, I will leave that for a review video after spending many more hours playing this game. The combat is simply amazing, it's stamina based and it's brutal. It feels awesome waving around with your axe, hearing the wooden shields blocking attacks and smashing heads of your enemies. The combat is really smooth and you can really feel that viking atmosphere and I really enjoy for now. Also the disruptible environment contributes the fighting atmosphere a lot. Combat in Valhalla feels a lot different than in Odyssey, on the positive way of course. Maybe because of stamina and a lot of people will say it's a bad thing, but if you ask me there is nothing bad with stamina based combat. Your stamina regenerates whenever you land a successful hit or you kill an enemy. The difficulty in Assassin's Creed Valhalla is really important as far as I can see, so choose carefully cause you'll be able to choose exploration, combat and stealth difficulty. So if you want to be cocky and to set all three on hard, you will find this game much more difficult than you thought. When it comes to graphics and details, the snow and cold no rail looks beautiful. The last time I enjoyed this much in an Assassin's Creed game was when I played the Assassin's Creed 3. I don't know, maybe I love winter and forest too much. The big change in game is the settlement of course, but I won't talk about it now cause I just scratched the surface of the game. So as far as I can see in these few hours, the game is really good. Maybe even the best in the series. Yes, I had doubts, I thought they will copy all the elements from the Odyssey and put them in this game and I'm happy I was wrong. The story so far looks good and I'm excited to see more of it. I know I haven't revealed much, yet this is my first impressions, if you want to see more you can already find full gameplays and some reviews on the internet. Unfortunately I didn't got the review key earlier, so I had to wait the release date to try this game. My review video will come soon, so don't forget to subscribe and press that bell icon so you don't miss it. And that would be it for this video guys, a like would be super appreciated and you can also find me on social networks and if you want to support growth to this channel and my work you can check my Patreon and become one, if you like of course. I am Baldard and you are on place where everything is about gaming. Until next time, see ya and stay cool.